hey hey today is the day after labor day so tuesday um september 7th and i am dressed to go to brunch with one of my friends her name is ariel i'm wearing these same pants that i wore to that date night that like fun game date night or whatever i don't know i think i told y'all about that but yeah these are from the beauty supply store this is from shein the top shein has like a lot of cute little tops and all I did was foundation in my eyebrows. I didn't feel like putting on any lashes. So yeah, I'm about to call her because I text her said I'm about to leave out because it's 21 minutes away from me and she ain't texting back yet. And let me make sure. Um, she said I'll be on my way in a few. <laughs> okay, never mind. Don't gotta text you. Um, yeah, so I'm about to go um, so I can get a parking spot. It's downtown. Um, we're going to the corner if you're local. I've never been there. I hear a lot of people talk about Red Door and the um, at the corner, I think is what it's called. So, yeah, hopefully it's good because I've heard mixed things about, I heard good things about Red Door, but I kind of heard mixed things about the corner. So we're going to the corner and I hope it's pretty good. I'm just excited for <laughs> mimosas, of course. So, yeah, I'm just going to wear some, um like this chill brunch, I feel like these pants are like really really huge so i'm just gonna wear flip-flops and yeah this is what i'm wearing let me close this blind up oh all right so about to head out now we plan to meet up at 11 30 and it's 11 12 and it takes me like i said 21 minutes to get there so i will get back with you guys once um we're actually there walking up to the restaurant I am so traumatized right now. A wreck literally just happened right beside me. Like this animal control service van or whatever literally just stopped. I guess, I don't know, he had stopped in the middle of the road probably to pick up some animals, some, something. I don't know, he stopped for a reason. And like this SUV type car stopped behind him. And this big old, kind of like an F-150 or like a Chevy Silverado, some like big truck like that, literally ran into this SUV. It was like a, um, I want to say it was something like a Jeep Cherokee. I don't really know the name of it, but yeah, that's what it was. And I thought it was my car, bro. Like my, I'm switching my insurances and stuff. Like my dad took me off his and I'm getting mine so I don't currently have insurance right now. Um, I gotta call this guy and get it like set up on my own so like I can pay it myself. Girl, when I took my heart is still racing, like I'm about to cry because I just knew that was me. Like they are making these cars extremely cheap right now, and that damn truck is done for. And I know that damn it was I think it might have been like an old Jeep Grand Cherokee, whatever, I don't know. But when I tell y'all that was a loud ass boom, <laughs> y'all, <laughs> I'm driving, but like I'm looking at the road still. <laughs> I don't have a um, camera mount, so like I'm holding it with my tripod. But y'all, I, I, I can't believe that. I've never seen a wreck like that close before. Oh my gosh. I pray everybody okay. Yeah, everybody got insurance and everything cool because mm mm. This, this, this why mm -mm, I bet they was either looking down at their phone or something because we literally we just had a red light and we literally just I mean we just had a green light and we literally just came through the light and we were all going slow y'all mm -mm. mm -mm. I just knew that I had to stop on the side of the road to um, make sure it wasn't me honey because baby I just got diamond we just got but yeah, um, on my way to brunch, it says I'll be there in 15 minutes, so I'll be there at 11.38, so. Ooh, do I got a mask? We need a mask. Uh, Probably not. Yeah. Child, push the light back. <laughs> Girl, she's jamming. <laughs> you can't even, ooh, I can't see. <laughs> do a whole vlogger. Hey, I'm 
for you every time I try to resist Taking it away I'm just beach blues and an every day All I wanna hear is an every since that we play Staring Alright, you some chicken strips You just say chicken strips With my head It is 1209 and she talking about some chicken strips. <laughs> <laughs> I am yes. busy. It's lunch. Bitch. So you know I want okay, to okay. I give you that. I give you that. And it. my potatoes. And, and I'm gonna get this. For my bread, I'll probably do a croissant. Like yeah, first one. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, Mm. Bye. <laughs> I don't ever know which one to get like when I'm in the store. Cause I'm like, what if I don't like it? I know, they've been looking at I wish they get more freaking bacon. So, I just got my iPad delivered. The guy, I think his name was Mario, so shout out to Mario. Thumbnail if you will. <laughs> this is the um, iPad Pro. I got the 12.9 inch, 256 gigs, fifth generation, Wi-Fi, cellular, whatever, you know. You know, you know. percent okay period what's that i don't know my um apple id password so english set this set. set up your new ipad use your apple id to connect yes sir because i sure don't know my mother freaking password <laughs> hold position to the pattern okay so I had to hold my phone over that little circle thingy. Enter your passcode of your phone. Let's cover that. I can't put my pants up because my belly button, these pants tight and I'm trying to let it heal properly. So if it look like I got a muffin top or whatever the case may be, sorry. Strictly I'm using this for, there it is, iMovie. Um, I'm gonna put i'm probably gonna put i'm definitely gonna do youtube all the youtube stuff i need um i'm about to try to make a new intro for myself the girl who made my intro if you guys didn't notice spelled my name wrong um tried to contact her didn't contact me back don't even know she still does them whatever whatever so um when airpods are connected siri will announce phone calls answer just by speaking to siri okay um so yeah um, I got these two apps from these, this girl on TikTok, it's called Impresso, and then like Baz Art or something, I don't know. I saved a lot of her stuff from TikTok, and I'm going to try it myself. You do get a seven day free trial, and I don't go back to work till Thursday, so I can spend like all night tonight, and tomorrow, and then like Thursday, like trying to figure out something. Okay, so I think I just said, I don't know. So I got this mostly for YouTube purposes, um, 
it's so cute how it looks on the ipad i'm about to kind of revamp my um youtube just slight changes um as you can see with mine i got this idea and tip from raven elise my videos they all have that pink box around them she said it just kind of makes people that like if you're you know how they like suggest videos it make your video kind of stand out more because all of your videos are aligned they're the same they look similar and you know it just looks better honestly oh, but so. i'm about to watch me some all of destiny up on here my battery's about to die um i got some leftover barbecue i'm about to eat ribs the beans i made everybody was raving about my beans baby i'm gonna be the one making the barbecue beans now at all the family functions i just see that now <laughs> so um i got some beans macaron you know the whole nine i showed y'all yesterday what i ate so i'm about to finish watching this hour-long video that she gonna bless us with and i'm about to just finish setting this up um i'll get back with y'all tomorrow i'm glad that i got this type of charger another block like this <laughs> so yeah that's what i'm about to do and i will see you guys tomorrow tomorrow Tomorrow, 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 tomorrow. Because tomorrow is when it's tomorrow. gonna happen. I'm gonna actually clean up my car. I know I've been saying that since the last vlog and this vlog. Tomorrow I'm gonna try to get up. I did wake up at seven the other day. Anyways, I'm gonna try to do my routine tomorrow and go clean up my car. Tomorrow, 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 tomorrow. Freaking car, like I said, I was gonna do. <laughs> so yeah, that's what that's what we got planned. Okay, so uh, hey guys, um. Today's been a few days. I think in this clip, I think I'm going to put together when I went to brunch and stuff in this clip. So today is actually Monday, the um, September the 13th. And I'm going to look at apartments before y'all even say it. I already know. Stop. Just just stop, sis, before you even say it. Um, I know I said I wasn't going to move until like three years. And in three years, it's going to be like out of state somewhere. Yes. But I'm not only looking, like I'm dipping my toe in kind of for me just scouting around because there's this place that includes all your like utilities and extra stuff into the rent. That's what I wanted. The only thing you would pay for is your lights. That's what I wanted. And so that's the one I'm about to go view today. He really pissed me off um, because I called and I was like, yeah, I'm looking for me and a friend. And I was like, basically, I'm more interested in the two bedroom. But my coworker, one of the nurses at the hospital, she was like, um, just look at the one bedroom. Like, you may really end up liking it because her dog is kind of like the size of like a golden doodle type thing. And mine, y'all know how big Prince is. He a little morky. So she was like, if I can fit in that one bedroom with this big old dog, like, you know, you can fit up in there with Prince. But I'm like, I got the extra bedroom because of, you know, I'm trying to do like a YouTube studio and stuff. But she was like, give it a try. So anyways, the guy, he was like, he asked for my friend's information and like I gave the name and the phone number. But then like he started asking, you know, like all the important like apartment questions and stuff. I'm like, look, this ain't my information. Like, I don't know. Like, I'm just trying to come view the apartment. And I understand that you have to put like fill out somebody, like fill out the um little, not really account, but like the mini application i guess i don't know what you exactly call it but yeah and i'm like i don't know like you're gonna have to ask you know my friend i don't know <laughs> so he was like okay hold on he got back on the phone he probably went to talk to his manager or somebody he was like well unfortunately i'm not going to be able to um show you this apartment since you said you're mostly interested in the two bedroom and this is the one bedroom i'm like you can put i started yelling i'm sorry y'all but i was like you can put my name down like akira <laughs> and I gave my phone number and everything and I'm like what like if someone's trying to move into your apartment and just want to see like why would you not break your neck to try to you know let somebody see the goddamn apartment so he put my name down and my phone number and I was like I will be there to look at the apartment and I go at 2 30 and it's 1 20 so I think I'm about to go get my car washed um I put in a clip of how dirty my car is I think I actually like recorded a video of it or whatever but yeah he pissed me off so bad this morning because <laughs> I'm like how you gonna say unfortunately you can't see the apartment because you you technically don't want the two bedroom but I may end up liking the one bedroom like come on now and I want to go see two other ones but they not answering the phone right now so one of them closed at 6 the other one closed at 5 30 so after I wash my car and go view this other apartment after I wash my car I'm probably gonna call back and try to set up an appointment but yeah i need to go find another flat iron too because the lady who actually did my hair in the last vlog she was like you need to get this flat iron because obviously the one i got now doesn't really get my hair as straight and flat as she did so i'm gonna um go try to find that so yeah i'm about to go to the car wash um 
I do need to vacuum out my car and stuff, but I'm not trying to get sweaty right now. You feel me? So, I don't know. We're going to see. But I'm definitely about to go wash it. Well, I need to vacuum it out before I wash it. That makes the most sense. Anyways, I'll see y'all at the car wash, okay? apartment complex and it decides to start raining just got my car wash as you can see in the last clip just got my car wash and I don't know if you can tell from up top but since it's raining I just cleaned my car oh my gosh bro anyways it's 2 11 my um appointment isn't until 2 30 so hopefully the rain stops in about 15 20 minutes or so yeah just want to hop on let you guys know that it's only a 30 percent chance of rain and they want to choose this side of town in little rock for it to rain great perfect but yeah it's raining just wash my car just thought i would throw that out there to you guys <laughs> okay so literally um I'm excited. Um, the two apartments that I went to go look at, they are fire. Um, I'll put in clips and stuff, obviously, so you guys can see, but I'm about to go home and kind of make my apartment list that I normally do. Um, I'll do like the pros and cons, what comes with this, what comes with that, what can I get with this, how far away from work is this, da da da. Like I do the whole rundown, like the rent insurance, like, like everything. So I'm gonna go home and do that. Uh, I wanna go, what I, Kira, Jesus, I wanted to go to this other place, but they won't answer the phone and they don't close till six. So I guess since I'm up here on this side of town, um, I'm about to go to the mall to use that coupon so I can get $20 off for, off of 60 spent. I'm going to get the seven for 35 pennies and then I'm going to do whatever else they I can get. So like I said, one t-shirt basically is the other. Thing. Okay, so I just got a new phone car mount. Why is this steady recording? Okay, so this was my old one. I get them from Five Below. This one still works. It's literally, I'm think I may get this to my mama actually. Um, it still works. It's just the suction one. 
um this one just pops in and out and adjusts to your phone or whatever um this one still works it's just my phone i actually have a phone case that already came with a pop socket so it literally can't fit into this one anymore obviously so this is the one that i have now this one is kind of like one of those little like chip clip ones so i literally just clip it on there as you can see so yeah that's that and i have a few bags in the back of my car this lady looking like girl i am not recording you honey okay unless you're looking at this guy right here okay anyways if you are interested this is the car mount that i'm using now from five below and this one is also from five below so these are the two papers that i got from the two pet policy fifteen dollars a month that's cheaper than what i pay now for prints a month so it's pretty lit um i'm about to go make a pros and a cons list i do need to actually i'm about to eat first let me make eating a priority and then i'm gonna um take prints out and then i'm gonna make my list i'm just about to cook a um cheeseburger because the burgers that i eat has 26 grams of protein and i need all the protein i can get okay so yeah so here's my comforter i have to um put it on i wash everything so yeah um i'll probably show up i took a video of like a before and after but this i've i was watching raven elise <laughs> i got me a um case for my ipad this is it i wanted something simple and obviously i love marble i always have marble everywhere and i also got a screen protector for it i haven't put it on yet i've had it for at least like four or five days now and it came with a two pack so i'll probably put this on today and then i went to five below i got some things for halloween so that'll be like in a separate vlog of me actually doing like halloween decor shopping type thing so i'm just going to save that for another vlog but um yeah i'm about to put on my comforter i literally had to wash it i mean i literally had to dry it three times with no heat three times no heat it still was not all the way dry so then i left it out on the couch last night and now it is completely dry i was just eating i had cooked me a burger and this is what i eat on on my tray if i eat in the room so i'm just about to make my bed um i guess i'll make it completely so you guys can see how it looks when it's completely made i've showed it a few other times but whatever we can do it again oh jesus let's move all this crap bed my pillows aren't straight because i'm just about to throw them back off but <laughs> this is me bad and then the tray i usually just keep my electronics and stuff on there like all of my remotes drawers and stuff like that up there but this is the messy way of making my bed so yeah so hey y'all i don't know if i <laughs> I don't know if I recorded me going to Walmart and getting a new flat iron, but I did. And I just used it and my hair, it looks so good. Okay, so, hey, <laughs> it's been a few days since I last recorded. Um, I actually went to go see 
another apartment today um i kind of want to sit down and kind of explain the reason why i've been kind of looking at apartments and kind of considering moving kind of not really but kind of <laughs> so um i I don't know if I already showed the videos or I may show the videos while I'm talking, but I'm going to go to my camera roll and look at the videos while I talk. Um, first off, one of the main few reasons that I'm kind of considering thinking about moving again is because this place kind of doesn't really feel like home, if you will. Um, maybe because I haven't really decorated it <laughs> like my other places. Um, I do actually have wallpaper. I bought wallpaper from Target. It kind of went viral on... Um, tiktok it's kind of like the um i don't know i'll put in a clip i don't know where i put it but yeah i bought some wallpaper i wanted to put it alongside this wall i am in my youtube studio room um i wanted to put it on this wall and then put like some pictures of me and stuff up so i feel like kind of once i like deck out my apartment i'll probably feel a little bit better about it and probably end up staying um but i went to go look at these apartments because i don't know i kind of miss my one bedroom like i miss having a one bedroom apartment um usually they're a lot bigger in space and what i mean by that is the kitchen is usually bigger most times depending on the layout and the bedroom is usually bigger and the living room is usually bigger so these apartments that i went to the first one that i'm going to show um that one i, I really liked all of them honestly and um, a big factor about the first and second apartment that I'm going to show you guys is everything's included. If you have been following me and been watching my vlogs or apartment hunting videos, you'll know that I really wanted to move into a townhouse. Like, I really love townhouses. Um, me and my best friend stayed in one when I went to A-State in Jonesboro. Um, our rent was $950. Everything was included. It was a two bedroom, two and a half bath, upstairs, downstairs, big kitchen, big dining room, big living room, everything. And I cannot find that here. Just Little Rock, their prices isn't like that. I actually did find a townhouse, but it's 30 minutes outside of town. I don't really want to drive 30 minutes to and from work. And then especially rush hour is, is just too much. So the first apartment I'll say I really liked because it had, let me see girl hold up <laughs> the first apartment i liked because it was a gated community i'll put up my apartment checklist i make it every single time i'm getting ready to move but the community is cute the clubhouse is lit literally have apple computers decked out it's a gated community everything's included they accept pets they have a dog park dog park is pretty small but um as far as the apartment goes the closet was huge i hate that the um washer and dryer is in the closet but i mean it's literally huge so it really didn't matter the bedroom was a nice size but like i said these are one bedrooms i look i'm looking at i didn't get a chance to look at any two bedrooms because they're all filled in all of these apartment complexes so i'm thinking like where would i put my vanity i can put it like behind the door i really didn't get a good video because the guy i didn't really like the tour guide but as far as the bathroom go goes, the bathroom is beautiful. It's a little bit smaller, but I do have a place in the kitchen for a dining room area. So I love that. I absolutely love the counter space. It is freaking, it's freaking huge. And the kitchen, I mean, the living room, it was pretty good too. It has a patio, balcony, whatever you want to call it. And it had storage unit space. And moving on to the second one. The second one I absolutely loved also. It also had space for, um... A dining room table this one actually comes with the garage i will say the kitchen is a lot smaller than my liking but i do have a front door and a back door this one kind of more so would feel like a home it also comes with two closets if you're my subscriber that told me to go look at these then you know who you are she actually dm me like a year ago i had already seen them but it kind of was like out of my price range then and obviously now i'm making a little bit more money so i can afford it but she told me to go look at these she actually stayed in the studio here and this is one of the one bedrooms so i really like this one and i'm showing you this um not complete like they don't even have all the flooring down so once i actually get to go back in there and see it fully complete then it'll be better it also has a pantry area the first one also had a pantry area i like this one because um the bathroom mirror is like touch screen so that was pretty cool like I said, it's just minimum counter space. That's literally the only flaw in this one that I really didn't like. They had a huge dog park at this one. I don't want to give too much of the location away because it is very noticeable if you are local and stuff. Like, you can find it very easily. <laughs> and then the last one that I went and looked at today is the third one. 
I actually, I actually like that it is the cheapest of all of them. Um, so much counter space. I love the open lighting coming in. This one had a huge, huge pantry. That definitely sold me. I told her that. Um, I also liked that the bathroom was like super cute and cozy. I can also fit my dining room table in here. The washer and dryer is inside the like bathroom. So yeah, not too bad. I am thinking like where would I put my vanity because I feel like this bedroom would kind of be crowded. So kind of the one I'm moving towards is the second one that I showed you guys. But I am still trying to find a townhouse. Like if I find a townhouse, I'm moving. No questions asked because that is what I wanted. But yeah, I kind of wanted to end the video me kind of explaining to you guys why I'm even slightly considering it. I know I said I wasn't going to move into like three years and it's going to be out of state, which I still feel that way. I'm just going to try to make this place a little bit more homey. So I'm going to be buying different things and decorating my apartment so it can be finished and I can get an apartment tour out for you guys. So until my next video, I will see you lovely Zen. Don't forget to like this video, comment, subscribe, and share. And yeah, the next video I think we're going to be um putting up all of my like fall, Halloween decor, stuff like that. So yeah, it's my next video. I will see you guys then. Bye.